Ross, that was another really entertaining game tonight. Um, ultimately, it's a point against a very good side as well, isn't it? Yeah, I think, well, again, without sounding negative, we'd, we'd have probably took a point before the game. Um, but obviously, uh, we want to win the game. Um, the, 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 I think we, we've, we're not massively disappointed, but there is a sense of disappointment um, in the sense that we want to win and obviously drawing is drawing and, and, and we want to we want to get more points on the board. So, yeah, I mean, like I said, we took a point before the game and they're a really good side there. They're, they've created some chances there and probably maybe, certainly first half, I thought was really toe to toe and a really competitive game. And to come out as early as we did and concede straight away, um, very similar to sort of Solihull and, and just switch off that little bit that little moment was disappointing but we dug in we didn't concede another and we probably even maybe could have nicked one at the other end so that was really really positive I think we obviously played we scored in the first half we were playing some really bright stuff there I think maybe did the goal kind of take the steam out of us a little bit would you would you say that's a fair assessment this, our, our first half was ours the second half was theirs maybe yeah but I mean I mean, there's, like, there's a little, you panic, not panic, I don't panic, but there's panic in the dugout, and they're a good side, uh, Dobra, how good is he, and, and then they're bringing Colclough on, and obviously McCallum's on, and then Quigley comes on for him, so, such a good team, and in and, and, and the reality of it, they, they, they outspend us, and, and they're much, much, much more money than us, and obviously, obviously, um, uh, their gaffer's done really well, to learn how they play, and it's difficult, and a lot of teams are going to struggle against them, and um, for us to, to be as competitive as we were and for the for, for majority of it is a really positive thing and we sort of run our stuff in the ground. It's a very kind of football manager question here but does, did you kind of have to rip up everything you said in your notes and that when there's, when there's a goal that, um, that quickly after the half-time whistle? Uh, yeah, I mean, I mean God, what, did we, what did we say at half-time? We wanted them to be brave and we wanted them to continue to take risks and, and to try and play forward and we wanted them to uh, press. They'll continue to be brave in the press, and in that, it's 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 it changes a little bit in sense. But we got more of the ball really with a goal, and you take a little bit more risk yourselves because then you're trying to score. And probably for the next ten or fifteen minutes, it was quite that even game again. And and then they sort of turn the heat up, don't they, and put a lot of pressure on you and make it really difficult and make those subs. So it's nice to get to the end of the game and not be here going all, all the shot I've conceded at the end all the shot I've conceded in the last minutes and we've we've lost one game in nine now and, and albeit runs and that are irrelevant and they've lost they've not won in four right and it's irrelevant because they're a good side and they're going to win but it just shows a little bit more consistency and they're a young group our group and, and they'll get there and they'll, they'll learn a lot in like these types of moments Jake got his goal um he looked very dangerous with, with those runs in behind. It was something that we saw a lot of tonight. You spoke before the game about you know trying to put maybe a bit of a stamp of your idea of football on there. Is that maybe what that is? In terms of running in behind and yeah, stuff? Yeah. yeah, I mean, li listen, uh, I don't want to talk about it, but we had a centre forward who we played around and our how we developed the style around one centre forward and it was effective and it became effective and it took us a while to get there. And then when we finally got there, we had this style and it linked into him and it linked into everybody else and allowed everyone else to do something. We don't have that anymore. So we're now learning a new style overnight. And until a new centre forward comes in who's either similar to him or maybe different to him, um, we're going to have to look to play a little bit differently. And we wanted to play different in terms of on the counter and on the break because we knew they'd have a lot of ball and we wanted to play in behind in the spaces because we know playing into people's people is going to be difficult with the physicality of their two centre backs so that's where we're at and, and that's what we try to do and it, it, it was semi successful I guess in the sense that we got a point against a really really good side. We didn't get a clean sheet tonight but I think you could say you could definitely argue that there was some real defensive sort of solidity out there especially towards the end and it was something we saw at the end against Dortmund as well when we were under pressure so that must be encouraging for you. Yeah well, we've got the defenders and, and Luke is learning and Haji, Oli, Tyler and, and um, uh, Tyler <laughs> were really good tonight and, and they were solid tonight and we, we, we played a little bit of a different system to try and sort of um, get a bit closer to them and, and try to try to, try to to match them up a little bit out of possession and it's hard because they rotate so much and Dobra picks up pockets of space, it's just a nightmare to get hold of so good on them, uh, they dug in and, and seen it out and like, like said in the previous previous question that there's times when we probably wouldn't have done that in the past so we bounce into a, what is a really really tough next three fixtures and I said to you I asked for a bit of patience and, and it'll get rewarded and 
fans again were excellent. The, 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 there wasn't many in the East Bank, but it sounded like there was, and it was noisy, and it was, it was, it's helpful. Of course, it's helpful. And um, I said to the players as well after the game, even the little like, sort of 50, fifty cuffs that we had in the first half, it, it all goes goes well to, to show that you care and, and being part of this this area and being part of this football club. Cheers, guys. Cheers, Sam. <laughs>